Welcome back to the pack. And if you're new here, my name is Jody. You can find me on Instagram as Worst of Wolf and Ravelry as Worst of Wolf Designs. And I invite you to be a part of our knitting pack. We're here to talk about everything related to knitting, whether it's knitwear, uh, designing, tech editing, holes, acquisitions, just anything that like really gets us knitting nerds going. So stay tuned. We're going to talk a little bit today about my uh, first knit and sip experience, which was amazing. And then uh, a couple of purchases like acquisitions that I really love. And I think you guys should know about it. So stay tuned. Okay, let's talk about the sip and knit. It was so much fun. It's the first one I've ever gone to. I feel like maybe like old Jody, I say old Jody, but like really baby bought Jody, like 20 year old Jody would have not gone. I would have been so scared, so nervous, but I'm glad that I went. I was a little bit late. I was running off to work. My phone was dying. That's why I don't have a ton of footage for you guys. So I'm sorry about that. I have a couple of clips that I'll add to show you. But yeah, I I loved it. I feel like even if you don't like to drink and you want to have a non-alcoholic beverage or no beverage at all, you should totally go because it's nice to be with people in your community. And one, just see some cool products being created. Maybe learn something from somebody, a technique you weren't sure on. And then just just get to chill out because like that's why we do these things right to like chill or at least I do I, I like to relax I think everybody likes to relax if you don't like to relax let me know I'm not sure if I've if I've ever felt that way I feel like I'm not relaxed enough anyway sipping it gonna add a little bit of an insert here like a little video of my experience it was a ton of fun I hope next time that I can like get more more videos and stuff like that. But like I said, my phone was dying and I actually think I was a little bit shy too. I was a bit nervous. Like, I don't, I don't know you. Nice to meet you. Um, can I video you? Like, mm, I'm not that brave yet, but hopefully I get a bit more confident vlogging in the wild. But yes, the short overview of sip and stitch, 10 out of 10, you need to do it. Okay, let's get into acquisitions. I am so guilty of buying like little knitting knickknacks. I just have to have them. If they're little, they're cute, I gotta have them. So yeah, I've had a little bit of a spend lately. But I feel like they're all little purchases, not too big. So I can I can validate them or you know, whatever you wanna however you wanna cut it. I deserve them. So my first one, you probably saw them on my last video my earrings they're like these little needle gauge earrings and they're so adorable they are from i believe it's like oink pigments and they do yarn too but they do like some earrings and things like that as well that's their their little card right there i don't know if you can see that oh yeah i see it right there they're super cute i got the cherry wood color and it goes really nicely with a lot of my outfits so yes 10 out of 10 would recommend they came in the mail pretty quickly i love them my next cute tiny item this look at it this is a um like the circle the snag free row counters it's like on the chain so you don't have to have like a like a row clicker they have like a little onion like a tiny little onion you're not gonna sit oh yeah there you are look at him you just look at him so this is from twice twice sheared sheep and it is a snag free row counter it is so cute they have um the charm on there and then this like little 
your little infinity thing and you clip it onto whichever circle you like and they have a lot of their um like tutorials on how to use them on their instagram so i'll link everything below like the earrings um the little row counter um all the fun stuff so i'm really excited to use this because I like to mark like every 10 rounds on like a vanilla sock and then like for sleeves and stuff like that too. This guy's going to come in clutch. It's going to be super cool. And she sent me some lollipops. I love lollipops. Super cute. What flavor did I get? Cotton candy and berry lemonade. Mmm. Tasty. This is her business card. And then hello friend. Hello, friend. Very cute. Cute business. Loved it. Also came super quick in the mail. Right. What next? Oh, I know what's next. I had to go to Michael's today because I, uh, I'm a hairdresser by trade and I have a dress that I'm doing a like 100 day dress challenge and I definitely got bleach on it. So I needed to get some dye. To color it so with that being said i also bought extra things at michael's i should have been getting just the dye but you know squirrel i i had to look and get things i saw these needles uh, in the knitting section and i've never seen them before if you've seen these or used these before like please comment below and let me know because I've never, I've never seen these. They have these little hook tips and they have a steel cord. And from what I am guessing, it's gonna wrestle a little bit with the, the cardboard. They look, yeah, they feel really lightweight. So yeah, like the cord isn't really like bent and like, you know, sometimes the, the plastic ones get a weird shape. Like the steel is nice. It's like nice and smooth, nice and straight. The join looks pretty good too. And yeah, they have these like little, little tips. Super interesting. But I like them because one, it's uh, a seven, and I use these for, um, which would be my other purchase from Michaels. Sugars and cream, good old, good old cotton yarn for dishcloths. This is going to be for Christmas. I love making dishcloths for Christmas. This. And this, they're going to be married. They're going to be husband and wife because there's just something about, like, go-to projects I always make. I kind of want them to have one needle. And they live together, and they're married, and they're happy. So excited to use this. I will let people know if I like this. I love this, and I also love, um, what is it, knit picks. They're um, dishy. That's really nice. I mean, sorry, love you. Dishy might be a bit better, but for the Christmas color, I can't beat it. So yeah, good old Michaels. Oh, and my other Michaels thing. If you haven't had these candies, you have to have them. They're so, so good. They have, um, so they're mango flavored, but then they have chili lime and sea salt like in the middle. So it's like a savory, spicy candy delicious so thank you michaels you rock my world my last big purchase and it, it is a big purchase so i guess i can't really say it's like a knit knack kind of thing i got my first purchase from nerd strings well bought it from my local yarn store but my first ever time using nerd strings this is the color dried roses i don't know what that looks like there but it's this like beautiful, dusty, mauve like super soft, real pretty. And yeah, I have a, a very special plan for this. It is 100% superwash merino, 438 yards, 100 grams, and it's full ply. So it's going to have a nice little squish to it. This is going to use on a shawl design that I'm working on. And I always keep saying on my like, Next video, next video, I'm going to talk about my designs. I know they've been bad. I haven't done my design one yet. I just really want to get some of the knitting done on some of them first so I can show you like 
more swatches and samples and things like that. So I swear, design, design stuff is coming. Uh, if you're on my Instagram, you'll probably see a little bit more teasers on there, like real short little clips. But yeah, Woo, squishy. All right, that is everything for acquisitions. We also talked a little bit about the sip and stitch night. I really hope you enjoyed this episode. Have a great evening, morning, whatever time zone it is for you. I'm going to enjoy my candy, my new knitting needles, and yarn. I just love, I love Christmas knitting. It just makes me so happy. And yeah, stay tuned for more. Like and subscribe so that you can always catch new episodes that go live here at Worsted Wolf. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.